Hello and welcome to GXG Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at what is center of gravity, center of pressure and their significance in an aircraft. What is the center of gravity or CG? Center of gravity on an aircraft is defined as a point where the entire weight of an aircraft is considered to be acting. The total weight of an aircraft should include the structural weight of the fuselage, the wings, the engines, fuel, payload. When an aircraft is in flight, the total weight reduces because of the consumption of fuel and oil. What is the significance of the center of gravity? Although the weight of an aircraft reduces in flight, there is only a small shift in the center of gravity. The CG is important because the pitch, roll and yaw movements occur about this point. This means that the distance of the primary control surfaces from the center of gravity has a big influence on the movements that are created on an aircraft. What is the center of pressure or CP? The center of pressure in an aircraft is a point where the total lift force can be considered to be acting. If we consider a typical aircraft wing, the lift distribution will be as shown here. If this entire lift force is considered to be acting at a particular point, it is called as center of pressure. What is the significance of the center of pressure? The center of pressure on an aircraft is not a fixed point and can move forward or backward depending on the amount of lift that is being created. If the angle of attack increases, the lift increases. The center of pressure will move forward. If the angle of attack decreases, the lift decreases and the center of pressure will move backward. It is important to know the movement of the center of pressure because this will have an impact on the stability of an aircraft. How do center of pressure and center of gravity affect stability? For an aircraft to be stable, it must be designed such that the center of pressure always lies behind the center of gravity. This means that if there are any disturbances on the aircraft, the tendency of the aircraft will be to come back to its original attitude. This is called as positive static stability. When an aircraft is in flight, even when flying at its maximum positive angle of attack, the center of pressure should always be behind the center of gravity for an aircraft to have positive static stability. If the center of pressure and the center of gravity are at the same location, the aircraft will have neutral static stability. This means that after any disturbance, the aircraft will have a tendency to maintain this new attitude. If the center of pressure lies ahead of the center of gravity, the aircraft will have negative static stability. This means that if there is any disturbance on the aircraft, the tendency of the aircraft will be to deviate from its original attitude, which is not desirable on commercial aircraft. So that's all for my video on the center of gravity and the center of pressure. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, do subscribe and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.